So it's summertime! Yay! Woo! <laughs> and people are now ditching the shoes and going to the flip-flops. <laughs> but today we are going to do a DIY on how you can glamorize your flip-flops from this to this. Pretty cute. Okay, your supplies are lace, ribbon, any kind of like material you can use. You can usually get it at Hobby Lobby for a couple bucks. Yeah, and you need scissors. I think everyone has scissors though, so yeah. you know what that is. And then you also need a cheap pair of flip-flops. We just went and got ours at Old Navy for like three fifty. They're really cheap. So and a hot glue gun. <laughs> and then and a paper so that it doesn't Or a plate or something to put underneath it so that it won't dry on your table. So I'm we're gonna start with mine first. And you're just gonna wanna take like I don't know, you can kind of just unwrap it for a little while until you have what seems like a good amount and then just Cut it off, and I you stick it through like this, your flip flop, pull it through, and then I usually measure it so that it is evenly put through, because you need an even amount on both sides. So that's even, then you want to cross them like so and then take one side and just pull it under and just start wrapping so you want to pull it through and then just wrap it over and then pull the ribbon under again and wrap it about halfway over the first ribbon and you don't want to cover it all the way or not cover it at all you just want it about halfway because it gives it a little bit of texture instead of just being flat and then you'll just continue on with that. I actually really like the wrap because it makes it look more thick so that it can look more like there's a different color of the flip-flop right here. Does that make sense? I really like this wrap. It's really cute. Yeah. Do you want to start on yours while I wrap? Okay. So as you can see, I just took a, a little piece of ribbon and I just laid it flat against the strap of the flip-flop and that showed the, um, the texture or the color or the design of the ribbon that you picked to go along with your flip-flop. And I'm just going to take the rest of this ribbon right here. And we're just going to start our flip-flop just like Brooklyn did by taking it and measuring it so that they're even like this. You're going to take this part and wrap it around the front of the little toe part. Wrap it around so you have one piece here and then one piece here. Then you'll want to take these pieces and cross them. So this one's going to go for this strap and this one's going to go on this strap. And you'll want to try and lay them flat right here where they cross so that you don't have a big bump on the top. And then you're just going to take your hot glue gun and you're going to put little dots all the way down your flip flop. You want to stop at the end and lay your ribbon flat on your strap of the flip flop. And you will have these little stringy of the glue. You can just take those off. They aren't on your flip flop. And we'll do it again on this side. Little dots all the way down your flip flop. And then lay the ribbon flat on the strap. And when you get to the end, you can see I have little, you know, ends of the ribbon. You can just take the scissors and cut those ends about as close as you can get them. And it doesn't matter if there's a little bit left over because the way the flip flops are designed, there's a little crease at the bottom of the strap that you can just tuck, so you see these little ends, you can just tuck them in underneath the strap of the flip flop and then they won't show. So you can just tuck them in right there. And there you have it. 
the flat laid ribbon flip flop. Super cute. And have you finished wrapping yours now? Yep. So uh, as you can see, once you're done wrapping, you have just a little end right there like that. And you'll just want to take your hot glue gun and put a little dab of hot glue on it. Just probably a little circle. And then just tuck it underneath that little crease like Bailey said and just stick it on like that and take all the little pieces off do the other side now so you just put a little dab on like that take it around and tuck it underneath in that crease like that now they're just kind of hidden away and you have finished your wrapped design flip-flop. Leave a comment below and tell us what other DIYs you want us to show you how to do. And don't forget to follow us on Facebook at Brooklyn and Bailey. And we, we will see you next week. Bye! Are you sure it's not the flip flops? No, they smell like plastic. They smell like Old Navy. What? <laughs> what does Old Navy smell like? I don't really know. Plastic? <laughs> you go around sniffing like the workers. <laughs> <laughs> you smell like Old Navy. <laughs> <laughs>